Mel Gibson and Harvey Weinstein Getty Images Mel Gibson, no stranger to offensive behavior, said the allegations leveled against pervy producer Harvey Weinstein are painful, but will trigger healthy change in the industry. Things got shaken up a little bit and there is a lot of light being thrown into places where there were shadows and that is kind of healthy, the actor and Oscar-winning director said. It's painful, but I think pain is a precursor to change, Gibson said while promoting his latest flick, Daddy's Home 2, his first comedy in more than 10 years, The Guardian reported. In 2011, he pleaded no contest to a misdemeanor battery charge against former gal pal Oksana Grigoreva, with whom he has an eight-year-old daughter, Lucia. The year before, it was reported that Gibson was heard in leaked tapes using racist language and threatening to kill Grigoreva. He is also alleged to have said she deserved to be beaten with a bat. In 2006, Gibson unleashed an anti-Semitic tirade against a police officer in Malibu, California, who had pulled him over for drunken driving. He accused F. Juice of being responsible for all the wars in the world and threatened to pee on the floor of a police station. Gibson was convicted of drunken driving for the ugly episode and completed the terms of his three-year probation. I acted like a person completely out of control when I was arrested, I disgraced myself and my family with my behavior, and for that I am truly sorry, he said in a mayor culpa statement after the incident. I have battled with the disease of alcoholism for all of my adult life and profoundly regret my horrific relapse. Last year, he took aim at the cop who collared him, as well as the media. It was an unfortunate incident. I was loaded and angry and arrested. I was recorded illegally by an unscrupulous police officer who was never prosecuted for that crime, he said, according to The Guardian. And then it was made public by him for profit, and by members of, we'll call it the press. So, not fair. I guess as who I am, I'm not allowed to have a nervous breakdown, ever.